Welcome back to Dropedia Tutorials. Today I'm gonna teach you how to draw spark plug from Fortnite. If you are new to this channel, be sure to like, subscribe, and comment below. I'm gonna draw on my Wacom tablet, but you can follow my tutorials with any other media that you have, whether it's pencil color, sharpie, or crayon. I'm gonna draw across a semicircle line for the top of her cap. I'm gonna extend it down on the side. And from the left side here, I'm gonna draw across a curved line. This point, and draw a semicircle line to the top and turn it to the left. Then I'm gonna make it turn down and back in at the lower point and out. And I'm going to make a sharp turn back up to the middle point at the top right there. And the same is going to turn back down. And at the side of that here, I'm going to draw a curved line to the right and turn it downwards. And from this point at the side of the here, I'm going to draw a curved line to the right and extend it out and the same is a good turn at that point back to the left and at this corner I'm gonna add a rectangular shape and another one inside of it now below the cap um, on the left side I'm gonna draw a curved line down to the side of her face and from this point, I'm going to draw a diagonal line towards her chin. I'm going to make a semi turn to the right side of her face and up. And straight up towards the cap. And for the hair on the left, I'm going to draw a curved line down from this corner. And I'm gonna draw a few strands of hair at the side here with a curved line down and out and sharp turn back up and another one from this point out sharp turn back up again and a few spiky shape at this corner And on the right side, a curved line coming down from this point and out, sharp turn back in. And a few more strands of hair below that, and a zigzag line to the chin. Below the head, I'm gonna draw a curved line down. And on the left side as well and turn it outwards to the side and for her face I'm gonna take this point and draw a curve line in and upwards in the middle and a curve line for the lower point right there towards the center and at the left corner of the eye, I'm gonna add a circular shape for her pupil and a small circle right there and a black one in the middle. And on top of her eye, I'm gonna draw a curved line right here. And for her right eye, we're gonna do a similar shape on this side and the eyebrow with a curve line turn it upwards and sideways now for her nose I'm gonna draw a curve line in the middle of the eye and at the tip of the nose 
a semicircle line right there and curve line on the side and for her mouth I'm gonna draw across a curve line and for the top lips I'm gonna draw a curve line up and down in the middle back up and down at the side and for the lower lip a curve line at this point right here Now on the right side of her neck, I'm gonna draw a curve line out and a semicircle turn at the shoulder and down. I'm gonna do the same thing on the left side over here. And for the inner line of that arm, a curve line down and across a curve line at this point and a line down on both sides and a curve line below that and I'm gonna continue the line of the arm below that shape and I'm gonna take this point and draw a curve line in to the right a semicircle turn for the outer line to the right as well and at the top part right there I'm gonna draw a rectangular shape and a curve line at this point down and across at the lower point right there and a curve line continuing all the way to the wrist right here and at this point I'm gonna make a curve turn diagonally up and extend it all the way to the tip of the finger same as a turn down and I'm gonna copy the same shape For the other fingers and at the side I'm gonna continue that and turn it back to the wrist with a curve line across the finger I'm gonna add a line on each of them right there and around the wrist I'm gonna draw a curve line at this point and a circular shape towards that point right there and I'm gonna trace the same outline with this inner portion right here and on the right side of that shape I'm gonna draw a curve line and turn it upwards and at the top part of the glove I'm gonna draw a curve line at this corner and a rectangular shape right here and some smaller rectangular shape at this corner and a circle at this point now going back to her outfit I'm gonna draw a curve line from this point down and out and back in and down and at the inner corner here I'm gonna draw a curve line now at the side of her shoulder on the left I'm gonna draw a curve line up to the shoulder and we're gonna draw a similar shape right here and at this point, I'm gonna draw across a line and another line below that. And I'm gonna copy the same curve line at this inner point right here. And then I'm gonna copy the whole thing on the right side as well. Now around her, the base of her neck, I'm gonna draw a curve line down from this point and I'm gonna make a turn towards the center and on the right side we're gonna do a similar shape and I'm gonna extend it all the way to the side and turn it down for the colors I'm gonna take this point and draw a curve line up Turn it sideways to the center and another line out from that point, turn it up. And I'm going to trace the same shape at this inner point and for the lower shape right there. Now at this inner point, 
I'm going to draw a line across and turn it downwards and trace the same line at this inner portion again and for her necklace I'm going to draw a string of circular shape going down and circular turn to the center and for the pendant I'm going to add a circular shape in the middle right here and another one at the center and we're going to continue the string of circles to the top on the right and for her shirt I'm going to draw across a circular line right here and another one at the lower point for the pocket on the right I'm going to draw a rectangular shape at this point and in the middle point inside of that I'm going to draw across a line and we're going to trace the outline of that pocket and the lower part of it and a line from this color down to the hand now for the other hand I'm gonna take this point at the side of the palm and draw a curve line down semi-circle turn back up and up and I'm gonna copy the same shape for the other finger and for the thumb in a diagonal position at the side and again across every figure I'm gonna draw some curve lines now below the hand I'm gonna continue the line of the outfit outwards with a semicircle turn and back down now below the arms I'm gonna draw a curve line down from this point and out and down all the way to her knee and I'm gonna make a semicircle turn at the corner and across a curve line at that point and semicircle turn back up in the middle right there and in the middle point I'm gonna draw a curve line at this point and for the left side I'm gonna draw a curve line down from this point And turn it outwards at that point semicircle turn down and we're going to do a similar shape at this point up and below that shape I'm going to draw a strap with a line at the sides and a curved line at the upper point and the lower point right there and inside of that I'm going to draw diagonal line across and a curve line at the lower point and we're going to copy the same strap again at this lower point right here and below that I'm going to draw a semicircle line at the side extend it down towards the knee and I'm going to make a curve line at the side in and back out and in and back out and a curve line in the lower point right there and on the right side I'm going to draw some wavy line at this inner line of the leg behind the knee and across a curve line to the front and for the knee pad I'm gonna draw a curve line at this point diagonal line at the front part turn it down and a line to the back then I'm gonna make a turn back up and a diagonal line at that point turn it down and a line across at this top section right there Below that, I'm gonna draw a curve line out and in and out and back in. 
and at the front a curve line at this point and a curve line across from the middle point here to the front semicircle turn to the side from the front I'm gonna draw a curve line down all the way to the ankle point and flare it slightly out at the front portion right there going back to the side I'm gonna make a turn down at this inner corner here and diagonally turn it back to the front and down and I'm gonna draw a strap at this point line down and curve line to the front copy the same shape at this lower point right here and I'm gonna draw this, the line of this piece all the way to the lower point right here turn it down back to the front and then I'm gonna draw a diagonal line to the right and across and for the boots I'm gonna draw across the curve line at that point turn it down at the side and extend it to the lower point right there and a semicircle line at this point and a curve line below that to the heels for the front part I'm gonna draw a diagonal curve line to the front tip of the shoe turn it sideways semicircle turn it down and for the front I'm gonna draw a curve line to the back right there and from the front and the back I'm gonna draw a line down and I'm gonna draw across from the back to the front a curve line turn it upwards in the middle point right there sideways back down and back to the front part along the base of the shoe I'm gonna draw a few rectangular shape like that and crisscross string at this point and for the left side I'm gonna draw a curve line down from both sides and we're gonna flare it up at the ankle point and on both points right there I'm gonna draw a semicircle turn inwards and across curve line below that on the side I'm gonna draw a line down and across curve line for the base I'm gonna draw some rectangular shape along the base and then going back to the top of the boots I'm gonna draw a circle at the middle point right here and a drooping teardrop shape at the side and another teardrop shape inside of that I'm gonna copy the same shape on the right side here and along the middle section of the boots from the top to the bottom I'm gonna draw crisscross knots like that and going back up to her outfit I'm gonna draw across a curve line around the waist right here and below that I'm gonna draw another curve line across and at the middle point I'm gonna draw a rectangular shape for the buckle and at the side at the lower point I'm gonna draw across curve line coming out to the side and two lines at the side of the buckle below the buckle I'm gonna draw a line down and another line on the left side and diagonally turn it to the right and 
on the left pocket I'm gonna draw a tilted rectangular shape and I'm gonna do the same thing on the right side and below that I'm gonna draw a curve line to the side and down on this side and back down and a diagonal line from this point right here and I'm gonna trace the inner shape of that pocket at the side and a circular shape at the top point right here I'm gonna do a similar shape at this left side a rectangular shape for the top continue it down and a triangular shape at that point a line down there and two in the middle and I'm gonna trace this line and the line at the side now on the left side of her arm I'm gonna add a curved line out sharp turn back in and another one below that and the curved line on the right side right here and that's all for our tutorial today i hope you enjoy it and find my lessons helpful be sure to like and subscribe to this channel also feel free to drop your requests suggestions or any other comments in the comment section below see you next time